all you beautiful people out there. I am Mrs. Realistic. Welcome once again back to the channel. I have a donation request from Michael Coughlin Jr. And this is for the warning when I'm alone live from the Pepsi Center in Mexico City. I haven't done this one yet, and I'm glad to get to some more warning. I've missed you guys. So if you like what I do, please don't forget to like and subscribe, drop a comment down below, click the bell for notifications so that you will always know when another video comes out. And without further ado, let's check it out. Pull off color on the outside, but I only see them black and white. I'm desperate for some light in the corners of my mind. Having hope but not enough, reaching out to find no one. Am I the only soul to have lost all control? It gets hard to breathe, stuck in between. On what has become my fake reality? You know, I've never seen just Danny by herself on the guitar. I don't know if it gets into more uh, later on throughout this video, but I kind of feel like she's singing about they are on tour all the time. They've got all these adoring fans. People see it as like, oh, you're rock stars. Life is so perfect. But nobody really understands. You know, it can be probably lonely at times, even though you're surrounded by people and you're surrounded by family it might feel lonely. The life of a rock star, the life of an artist, most people can't understand that. I know I certainly couldn't. But, you know, at the same time, even if that's not what she's singing about, the emotion in her voice, it's making me tear up. It's just this beautiful, haunting voice, just her and her guitar, peeling away those layers of all of the extras, just really hearing her emotion in this song. I'm about to tear off this page, but it's something I can raise. I wish I could rewrite the story of my life while I hide every day behind the there's pain they say i'm not alone but do they even know it gets hard to breathe stuck in between on what has become my fake reality and there's no escape from the voice in my head it's driving me crazy nobody understands my
Somebody tell me what she's saying. Okay, I'm going to put on closed captioning because um, I want to know what she's saying to everybody and see if I can get to the right spot. I'm sure you won't all mind enjoying this over again, but I really want to know what she's saying. It's uh, something that clearly the crowd is loving. Look at her eyes. Amen. my goodness. I didn't bring any tissue again. Okay, I had to go get something to dry my face off. I'm so glad I could get the, that closed captioning. That just brought it to like a whole new level. This was so beautiful and stripped back and personal. How she's singing about being alone and how they're singing along with her about being alone, but they're all together and they're all going through like a catharsis together and realizing that you're never truly alone. There's always somebody there. And the fact that she says, you have me, you have my sisters, and we sing this song together when we're all feeling alone. That is such a beautiful sentiment. It always comes back to what wonderful people these women are and how healing I think their music is for a lot of people. It's not just awesome, rad rock music, but they have these songs that are so beautiful and emotional and heartfelt. They are also such lovely down-to-earth women. And I think that uh, this is very few and far between and so rare now and why they are so special to so many people, including myself. They can make you feel energized. They can make you feel like you want to jump up and down and they can make you cry at the same time. And such a huge kudos to their parents for raising such wonderful people. So this was a little bit of a gut punch to start my recording day but a beautiful song. And I'm so grateful. Thank you, Michael, for requesting this one. Thank you, everybody, for watching and maybe crying along with me. I hope you are all having a wonderful day. And as I always say, we'll see you in the next one. Peace. Mm -hmm.